the same people you think you doing this for is laughing at you. They ain't laughing with you, bruh. They're not laughing with you. You understand what I'm saying? They're not. You are a clown. A freaking clown. That burn bridges with people and all that. You didn't burn bridges even in this. Because I had this lined up to go to a whole lot of people. You know what I'm saying? Now they don't even want it because of your stupid ass. You know what I mean? You talk too much. That's your problem. You talk too much. And you need to shut your mouth. That's what you need to do. And you know what? To make a long story short, what these people have actually done is, Steve and whoever, what they have done is they have turned something that I was going to do into something negative. That's what they have done. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, when I talk to AJ, Average Joe, you know what I'm saying? He posted something about it, but I know Joe knew. He knew. He knew I had it. And I texted him and told him I had it. You know what I'm saying? I don't run from shit. You understand? And Average Joe know that. He know I'm not going to run from this. And you think you could get it up? Because, <sighs> look, look. You got a better chance of having sex with Janet Jackson than getting that off with me. You understand what I'm saying? Man, look. Steve, 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 Steve. <sighs> you said on your Instagram that you weren't going to call out no names because that's not what you do. Maybe. Maybe that's not what you do. But you know what? I'm calling out your name. Steve from The Watch Corner. You know what I'm saying? From The Watch Hut. From The Watch Street. Whatever you want to call yourself. Know what I mean? I ain't got time. To, I'm too old to be playing games like this with people. You know what I'm saying? And, and if your beef stems from whatever the Tudor bro shit, from a fucking shirt, from this or fucking that, you know what? You wrong, bro. You need to grow up. You need to grow up. You need to get the motherfucking wedgie out your dungarees, bruh. That's what you need to do. But the point is, man, is that you weak. You weak, bruh. You desperate for attention. You know what I'm saying? I don't crave attention because I'm already, I'm a star anyway, regardless of what. I don't crave attention from anyone. I've been a star, bro. Where you been? What you know? You know what I mean? I've been a boss. Still a boss and will always be a boss because ain't nothing you could do to change that. You know what I'm saying? And the real people in this watch hobby that know they know you understand what i'm saying not them corny silly looking funny boy i just want to say so much i just want to say so much but you know what steve i'm gonna leave you and your crew alone i'm gonna leave you and your crew alone because you and your crew some clowns see me and my crew we loyal if i got something to say to them i say it to them i ain't gonna put it on instagram and act like no punk like you steve i go to omar david Miguel, whoever. You know what I'm saying? That's just the way I am. And then what, what really baffles me is with some of these guys is you have my phone number. You have my phone number, Steve. If you wanted to watch that bad, I would have sent it to you. You know what I'm saying? Because I've been busy with life. You know what I mean? Period. Point blank. If you wanted it, I would have sent it to you regardless of what I felt about you. You know what I'm saying? Regardless of how I feel about you, I would have sent it to you, bruh. That's why this breaks my heart. That's why this breaks my heart, man. You know what I'm saying? I hate to put the ether on somebody. But you know what I'm saying? Some people ask for the ether, though. Some people ask for it. And that's what you're going to get. You know what? I was me, me and my man Miguel, you know what I'm saying? Our 100 episode SoCal Watch Reviews podcast is coming. And we got the legendary TGV coming up. And I asked TGV, this is just a little spoiler. And I, I asked TGV, how do you get around all the negativity with people throwing dirt on your name and talking all kind of shit? How do you get around that? And this guy was so humble. You know what I mean? 
And he generally don't care. He doesn't care. But see, I ain't there yet. I ain't on that level yet. Like, that's real high level shit for him. That's real high level shit. Like me, nuh-uh, nuh-uh, nuh-uh. I've been out the hood for a long time, bruh. You know what I'm saying? I've been out the hood, been stabbed, shot, all that. I've been out the hood. You know what I'm saying? For years. And then came up. But you know what? I just can't let stuff like this go. Now, I could have been made a video like this. Could have been made a video like this, yo. But I gave you a grace period. I gave you a grace period, Steve. You know what I'm saying? And you knew I had to watch. Why didn't you call me if you so big and bad? Like, Steve ain't no boogie man. He a booger man. He ain't no boogie man. Steve is generally a sucker MC. You know what I mean? Generally a sucker MC. And that's it, point blank. Sucker MC. I ain't got time for that. But like I said, I am no way, shape or form, trying to keep this watch. You know what I'm saying? It is a great initiative and I'm with it 100%. It's just that I got busy. And I'm gonna tell y'all something else. I ain't gonna send the watch to Steve. Nope. I'm not gonna send the watch to Steve. Somebody else will get it before Steve get it. But you know what, Steve? I'm not sending it to you because I'm petty as hell. You know what I'm saying? You had your chance to be cool with me. You had your chance. But you trying to slander my name out here in these watch streets? You know what I'm saying? I ain't saying nothing about you. You know what I mean? You think your shit that hot, cuz? You think your shit that hot? I'm about to put out that flame. For sure. Ether is on. Again, yo, shout out to JD, Traveling the Watch Project. I appreciate you lending me the watch. You know what I mean? Um, But I won't be sending it to Steve. I'm going to send it back to you. And I want to give you some advice, sir. You know what I'm saying? Because you are a dope guy. You're a cool guy. Uh, Steve is not the person that you want to do business with. Steve has burned bridges with micro brand brands. He's thrown people on the bu under the bus and he will continue to throw people under the bus. If you make Steve mad, he will throw you under the bus and your initiative, sir. I'm just keeping it 100. I'm just keeping it 100. Because the guy Steve, he living in the shadow of Average Joe. He wanna be Average Joe. Why can't you just be Steve from the watch corner? Why can't you just be Steve from the watch corner? You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. Before you slander my name or anybody else's name, think about the silly shit you say. You know what I'm saying? You just silly. You silly. And it's all wrapped up in a, in a lawnmower brain like you got. You know what I'm saying? Period. Point blank. And the people you have thrown under the bus, some of the ones that's on that same post that you posted about me, some of them people that you threw under the bus, you would be surprised what they say about you, bruh. So don't get hyped. Don't get happy be thinking you got a following. Because again, the same people you meet going up, you're going to catch coming down. And guess what? I'm going to let your ass fall. Peace. And I'm out. Shout out to the Traveling Watch Project. Thank you, JD.